hang up and try again. How long have you known this Mr. Alex? Well, I mean, I just heard about him from you today. So you, you, so you, wait, you don't know him? No, no. Oh, uh, okay. So how many days left do you have to live? Um, I'm not sure what you mean. Well, after 30 days of nothing but jack-in-the-box, your days surely are numbered. I, I don't think so. I, I think I'm okay. It's already 30 days past that point. Denial is... A river. No. Yes. What, what would you say is the number one symptom that the devastation a pure jack-in-the-box diet would cause to the human body? Well, with all the harmful chemicals and everything else flowing and coursing through your veins, I, I feel like there would just be a, a lava flow. Pure lava, pure right out the anus. Lava. It would pour through every layer of intestines, burning through each level, and yeah. then straight out the anus. Almost explosive-like. I mean, explosive. if, you, if you weren't on there regular, you would probably shit yourself. A lot. To death. Yeah. If, if your heart didn't give out, your, your intestines would. Thank you, Doctor. You're so... I'm smart. Not as a doctor, but... What? How did you get used to having diarrhea every day? I didn't have diarrhea every day. Devastating to the lower intestines. It was not devastating. Devastating. Not. <laughs> Good morning. First mile of the day complete. So, today's workout, I'm calling in. Mamba mentality. Um, my last meal was at 8 p.m. We're gonna fast till 8 p.m. today. That's 24 hour fast. I have an eight hour time period to complete 24 miles. So this is gonna be a true test in Kobe fashion. Miles, fasting, mental, physical, toughness. What up guys? So it's day 22. I'm almost <clears throat> done with this challenge. Uh, today was a crazy day. Uh, the day after Kobe Bryant passed away. Um, so today I <clears throat> dedicated my workout and everything to him. Uh, did a 24, did a 24 miles running. Um, I completed in under eight hours and I stayed fasted for 24 hours. So this is gonna be my first bite uh, at 8 p.m. Uh, on day 22. So this is uh, January 27, 2020 today. It's been a pretty rough uh, day. I'm from Los Angeles and uh, you could just totally, totally feel it in the air today, man. Uh, it was rough, so. Jack how can I help you? Hi, um, you know, can I get in number eight? Number eight? Yes, please. Okay, what size combo? Uh, large. Trolley fries or regular fries? Regular fries with the Diet Coke. Okay. But can you add two extra patties to that, please? Sure. And then uh, loaded mini tacos, please, as well. Day 22, solid. Um, so far, so good. Quick little, I don't know, Jack in Box is doing me solid right now, so. Uh, a few more days to go. It's almost lunchtime, so bad news for anybody hanging out with me. Actually, good news is they get to eat where? Jack in the box. Yes, sir. Hey, can I get a number 13 curly fries? And then a chicken fajita pita on its own with extra chicken. Yeah, no cheese. That's it. West Coast Customs right here. It's getting close to the end, everybody. Jack, 
about to get my dinner. I've been pretty clean so far this week. Can I get a Jack Spicy Chicken Sandwich, uh, protein style, no mayo, uh, without cheese, and then a chicken club salad, uh, extra chicken in that, and a large Diet Coke, please. I wonder if these guys are sick of seeing me yet. What's up, guys? Four more days left, and we're back at, where are we going? Jack in the Box. That's right. <laughs> Jack in the Box right here. Jack in the Box right here. I'm actually pretty hungry today, so. Order one of everything on the menu, please. Yeah. Can I get uh, two chicken fajita pizzas, please? And a large Diet Coke? You sure do. I've been eating Jack in the Box for almost 30 days now. Oh my god, how's that going? So I've lost 20 pounds. What do you eat every day? Not every day, I've eaten everything off the menu. Everything. everything? I've had cheesecake, shakes, I've had only Jack in the Box. Fucking Super Bowl Sunday. I'm chopping up steak, making mushrooms. We're about to make some Philly cheesesteaks. And you know what I have to eat today? Salad. And that's okay. You know why? Sick. <laughs> Maluma, baby. Maluma, <laughs> baby. This is what's happening right now. Super Bowl Sunday, day 26. Wants to pay off your student. I made I made that shit. But he What's up guys? We're back. Jack in the box. We have two more days left. So we have tomorrow and Wednesday is my last day. Almost done. So in this quest, you of course skip dessert. Only ate salads. Absolutely not. I ate everything off the menu. Yeah, actually, can I get an ultimate cheeseburger combo, please? Strawberry shake. Grande sausage burrito on its own, please. No cheese. And then uh, ultimate cheeseburger by itself. Oh, sorry, and the large uh, diet coke. Guys, we're back. It's day 29. I have one more day left. About to drive through the Jack in the Box almost for the last time. Bittersweet. Um, got my Dexa scheduled. We pushed it till Thursday, so I'll be done with the full 30 days and we'll be ready to go. So we're about to pull into Jack in the Box right now. Chicken teriyaki bowl with no sauce. And a chicken fajita pita, please. And a large Diet Coke. That's it. Thank you. I made it through. Uh, it's been 30 days, just Jack in the Box. Um, I've had, besides for Jack in the Box, I had some ice cream, but I ate a whole gallon, so I think that doesn't apply to health food. I also had 10 shots of tequila and a bunch of whiskey, also not considered health food, so I think that's okay. I was gonna do my uh, DEXA scan yesterday, but we postponed it till tomorrow, so it'll be day 31. I think it'll be a more true measure. I'm going to go get my blood work done also tomorrow to see if anything happened internally. I doubt it, totally fine. Hey, yo, check it out. So you're my last delivery for Jack in the Box. Uh, I've been eating Jack for 30 days. 30, yeah, I've been delivering you for a you, while. You have been? Yeah. No way, no yeah, way. Almost every day. Almost every day. Yeah. This is the best. It's my last few meals, guys. Only see it fitting to finish my Jack in the Box challenge with a Jumbo Jack. Done. 30 days, Jack in the Box, check. It's so bittersweet. It's my last day, Jack in the Box. I'm on my last drive, about to hit Jack. I'm not gonna go drive through, I'm gonna walk inside and savor the moment last day of my 30-day challenge i've been eating jack in the box for 30 days wow yeah that's crazy crazy last meal right now 
You're taking my last Jack in the Box order. Cool. Cool. So what's it gonna be? What do you think I should have? Let's go big. Let's go Number big. Five. Number five. Number five. One double. Double. Yeah. Double Jack. All right, we got it. Let's do it. All right. What size? Small, medium, or large? All right. You said go big, so we're gonna go. The party bags or regular? You call it. Party bags. You got it. Drink. Uh, Diet Coke, please. All right. Anything else? That's it. For here to go. To go, please. But it's gonna be 1027. You got it. So what do you think happened in 30 days? I was hoping you would probably gain weight, but doesn't look like no. it. No. No. I lost 20 pounds at least. Really? Yeah. You need check in the box? That's it. You got it. Let's do it. <laughs> Thank you. Surely you put on pound after pound after pound after pound of body weight. I can see it. You're enormous, rotund, disgusting. I lost pound after pound after pound after pound after pound. I think you gained it. Lost. Is English your first language? Yes. C. C? See the picture. He ate. Jack in the Box for 30 days. He was better than 10 days ago. And he lost the weight. We should do what he's doing. That's what's up. <laughs> On what? On what? You completed 30 days of oh, checking the box. Oh, yeah! <laughs> okay, guys, so like an idiot, I drank a bang before I came, so I can't take my blood test today. I have to come back tomorrow. God damn it! What up, guys? It's day 31. I'm on my way to Culver City to get a DEXA scan. Uh, blood draw time trying to convince doc to actually get on camera and talk about what happened with the blood work uh, he's a little shy so <laughs> we're gonna have to work on that enjoy your food it's gonna be okay it's gonna be okay it's gonna be okay it's gonna be okay Got him. I carved up for you last night. Thank you. I did. Thank you. Yesterday I had ramen, I had a strong sandwich, oh, I, had, I had like a whole bunch of French rolls, I had cereal. I have here in front of me the menu of Jack in the Box. Mm -hmm. Not a very diverse menu. Not very inclusive. No. Not many healthy options, would you say? Well, I mean, they do have salads, but it's just iceberg lettuce, which is just water, right? There's yes, no absolutely. They, so if somebody were to eat this for 30 days, they would have to be malnourished. The only other thing I can think of is like, if this doesn't have nutritional value, obviously he's chopping chopping stuff up and in order to get maximum nutrient content is, is 
using it as a suppository, you know, like like those teenagers and the the, the tampons would yes. they shove up yes. there for yes. getting drunk at yes. concerts. Soaking tampons in iceberg lettuce and shoving it up his ass. You well, heard it here first, everybody. Alex Tima from Dr. Tyler Scheid has said Alex Tima is using spinach as a suppository. Yes. I'm gonna get a B12 shot to end all of this right now. So get a little energy in me. So obviously you overdosed on fat with every meal, right? No, actually, I was moderating my intake. I was making sure I stayed within a correct macro profile. So I actually stayed right within my numbers. Those numbers being 100% fat. Actually not 100% fat, 100 grams of fat, yeah. A hundred grams. Yeah. Wow. Wow, yeah, no, it was a uh, hundred grams of fat. We had about 120 grams of protein and about 200 grams of carbohydrates. So I was right within my macro profile, uh, which I created for myself. For those who don't know, a hundred grams of fat is equivalent to 15 pounds on the human body. That's not true. At all. hundred grams is, no. I don't think your math checks out there. Pretty sure my math checks out. How many heart attacks did you have in this quest of insanity? None. How many heart attacks did you have in this quest of insanity? None. <clears throat> just dub over him saying like five. Okay, just put it in. You got it. Okay, cool. Yeah. So, what I imagined he looked like after 30 days was just covered in acne, skin folds, morbidly obese. Like, he went from probably being relatively healthy, maybe, to absolutely round. What would you say to those out there, the innocent minds that are being subjected to this misinformation, that are thinking of trying fast food and talk directly to the camera? I would say don't do it. It's, it's, you'll be trapped in it forever. But I will say, you know, Alex looks great. Get, get the fuck, get out. Get out. There's no door over there. <laughs> <laughs>